Hello, my name is Mark. I am a student of English and this is my story. I want to tell you about my life in London and about my fantastic teacher. You can read my story and learn English with me. It is a beautiful summer day and I am traveling on a train. Two ladies sitting opposite me. I don't know them, but from their conversation, I know they are foreigners. I don't understand much of what they are saying, but I know they speak English. I also want to speak English, but I am a beginner. I don't know many words. However, this is an opportunity for me to speak English. I decide to try to speak to the ladies. I say some sentences in my basic English and they understand what I say. I don't know many words and I speak slowly. Kind and patient. I am able but the ladies are to have a simple conversation with them. I tell them that I want to learn English. They are happy when they hear that and they tell me that they are from England. They are traveling home from a conference. We speak for about 10 minutes then it's time for me to get off the train. While I am thanking them for speaking with me, they give me their address and phone number. I work on my English for two hours almost every day. In six months, I am able to speak quite well. It is great, but I want to know more. I decide to go to London to study English there. In London, I choose a school which I expect as good. I really look forward to my first lesson. The lesson is on Monday. On my first day at school, I meet my teacher and the other students in the class. My teacher is a young lady. She is very nice. She asks everybody to introduce themselves and say where they are from. Then the lesson starts. Our teachers ask us how we studied English before and what we suppose as the best method to learn English. I tell my teacher that I like translating songs and other text but I don't know what's the best method to learn English as. Our teacher says that she will teach us a very effective method which is based on using the language. Our teacher tell us that we will not have to study and we will not use textbooks. We will immerse ourselves in the language. It is great for me since I don't like studying and I don't like textbooks. Then we speak about what we should focus on when we learn a new language. Our teacher tell us we need language for communication. Languages help us say ideas and understand ideas. So, when you learn a new language, the best way to learn is to use it for exchanging ideas. This is what we will do in our course. Most of them we will speak. You spoke a lot when you learned your native language as a child and you should speak a lot when you learn English as an adult. Unfortunately, many students spend a lot of time on memorizing new words or learning grammar rules. They don't use English for speaking. They study about the language but they don't use it very much. Of course, you need to learn new words and new grammar but you don't actually have to study them. During this course, I will show you a very simple and effective way on how to learn new words and grammar. I like what our teacher say. Our lesson continues. We speak about our hobbies and what we do in our free time. We speak in fairs or with our teacher. It is great. And we speak for the entire lesson. I enjoy it so much. I have never spoken so much English during one lesson in my life. I have never learned this way before. I am happy and I look forward to the next lesson. I am happy and I look forward to the next lesson. How to learn words. I go to school on Tuesday again. One of the students asks a question that is interesting for me. She asks what is the best way to learn new words. Our teacher says there are many things you can do to learn new words. I will tell you what is statistically the most effective way for learning new words. Thank you.